Sports, and we're getting to Hoosier land now, huh? You know, opposite the Ohio State-Michigan game last Saturday was the Kentucky-Duke Kentucky basketball game. Did you yes. get to see any of it? No. Oh, it was an incredible amount of talent on there, and there's an incredible amount of talent just right around this area. This is going to be one fine year for college basketball, and Makes we're going to take a look at all of it starting Nobody right now. Nobody undefeated, though. Huh? Nobody undefeated. <laughs> well, we've done a lot of talking about that basketball trip Walt Mayer took to give us a little close-up on some of the top basketball teams in the country right here in our backyard. Well, let's take a look at the first one. This is being billed as some kind of year for college basketball, and the hotbed for it all is right smack dab within a 250-mile radius of Cincinnati, where no less than five of the country's top teams in preseason polls hold court. Indiana, Kentucky, Notre Dame, Ohio State, and Louisville. Eyewitness 12 videographer Barry Conrad and I hit the road last week for a little preview. We've already shown you Kentucky's great crop of freshmen here, Sam Bowie, Manyfield, Derry Cord, and Charlie Hurt, but we want to show you that outstanding gang they have at Notre Dame with Kelly Trapuca here and the antics of Digger Phelps. Ohio State's outstanding freshman Clark Kellogg, the Bucks will be tough. But tonight, we start our series at Bloomington with the Indiana Hoosiers getting the spotlight and, of course, Bobby Knight. Indiana is number one in both preseason wire polls. It's just um, an indication that, that people who don't know a heck of a lot about what they're doing have to pin the tag on somebody, and I mean that somewhat facetious. They always get a kick out of number one ratings in, in every sport. Like, I have not seen very many people come forth that predicted the Pirates would win the World Series last year. April or March, you know, and I, I get a lot of, uh, of enjoyment out of, uh, I would if I just see one guy sometime write an article about the middle of the season apologizing for his preseason pick saying, well, I just didn't know nearly as much as I thought I did, but I don't ever see that. Bobby Knight was telling it like it is, but on his best behavior he was when we dropped in on Assembly Hall. Maybe the posters are full of baloney, as Bobby says. But don't you tell that to the Russians, who were simply clobbered by the Hoosiers. And the Russians, no need to remind you, are no slouches on the court. They're ranked number one in the world. Indiana has everybody back from a team that finished down the line in the Big Ten, but came on strong to win the NIT. They'll feature a starting lineup of Middletown, Ohio's Butch Carter, Mike Woodson at the guards, an All-American candidate, Eisenbarger, Whitman, and Tolbert. And Knight has a super freshman in the person of Isaiah Thomas, a 6'1 guard out of Chicago. We wanted to talk to Isaiah. Knight said nothing doing. You know how it is with these stars. We know. We know indeed. So Knight did some more talking himself. It's a, been a very interesting preseason for us because I think we have uh, better internal competition on our team than we've had in the last six years. I think we have more people that are capable of playing and therefore our practices are much more competitive than they've been in a long time. And, and I've always been of the opinion that, that uh, a basketball team is for the most part developed in October and November. After a two-hour plus Bobby Knight disciplined practice featuring more Knight takes and a Hollywood movie director, senior guards Carter and Woodson looked at their final merry-go-round. How do you see this race in the Big Ten this year, Butch? Well, I think it, I think whoever jumps out in the front and grabs the lead early in the first six games in the first two or three weeks, then those will probably be the, the couple of teams that'll stay on top the rest of the year. That's the way it's been the last three years I've been here. I've been here, and I expect it to stay about the same. So let me ask you this: You've been around here. This is your fourth year. What is the, the uh, key to the success of this Indiana basketball team? Well, you know, coach stresses defense. And that's been stressed ever since I came as a freshman, and that's always going to be stressed here. And I think that's the key to us being a great team, is playing the hard defense and rebounding. Well, you know, for the life of me, I can't understand at this stage of the game how anybody could pick anyone, the best basketball team in the country on the college level. The Indiana Hoosiers may not be number one, but they'll be interesting, to be sure. Bobby Knight will see to that. This is Walt Mayer for Eyewitness 12 Sports, Indiana University in Bloomington. And now tonight at 11 o'clock, we're going to get a, a more in-depth interview with Butch Carter from Middletown and what he thinks about Bobby Knight. And then tomorrow night at 5.30, an extended interview with Bobby Knight on Bobby Knight. Huh. Pan Am, everything. We'll okay. hear it. Good. Yeah. Sounds interesting.